All this campaign work sure has made me hungry. Why don't we all go get a sandwich? Oh, I know this perfect place. But if it's after nine and it's closed, maybe if we honk the horn, this will bring one out. Okay, we can't do that. Not only is it annoying, but if we were in Arkansas, it could put all of us in jail. Did you know that in Arkansas, it's illegal to honk your horn at a sandwich shop past 9 p.m.? Arkansas, Louisiana, and Mississippi, Sarah Oriana. Good morning, Your Honor. If it may please the court, I would like to enter into evidence exhibits A, L, and M that they may be used during my opening statement. Ladies and gentlemen of the jury, I will prove to you today beyond a reasonable doubt that all jurisdictions of the International Order of the Rainbow for Girls throughout the United States and other countries, despite their differences in customs and traditions, have the same mission and goals. Exhibit A shows a 12-year-old girl, Lietzel, who is currently Arkansas's Grand Representative to California. Even though Grand Representatives in California are also Grand Officers in our jurisdiction and are of age at least 16 years old, Lietzel is very proficient in her ritual and speaking and shares an equal love for Rainbow. Passworthy advisors in their jurisdiction remain active and can still hold another Grand Office after their year is over. The State Service Project this year in Arkansas is Friendship Rocks, and the colors of the year are the seven colors of the rainbow, and the theme for this year and for Grand Assembly is Paint Your Own Canvas. The Grand Officers also assist with initiations throughout the year. In Exhibit L, you can see Louie, who is Louisiana's Grand Representative to California, and who is also this year's Grand Chaplain. She's seen wearing a hoop dress, like many worn in California. Although grand officers in Louisiana do wear hoop dresses, they're not required to wear hair pieces. Many of the grand officers this year did a lot of traveling, including Lily, who attended an installation in California during her grand year. Celebrating 97 years this year, this year's theme is coming together in rainbow, also using all seven colors of the rainbow and an elephant as their mascot. Their state project this year is collecting and sending care packages overseas to the military. Exhibit M represents Rainbow in Mississippi, with photos of Zoe, who is Grand Representative to California and Grand Patriotism. Straight dresses are worn by Grand Officers in this jurisdiction, and they also do not wear hair pieces. Like many of us here, Zoe comes from a rainbow family and is the daughter of a past Grand Worthy advisor. The theme for this year is Be the Light for All to See. The Grand Worthy advisor selects symbols for her term, which this year are lanterns and fireflies. She also chooses a flower to represent her term, which this year is the hydrangea. The state service project this year is the Memorial Hospital Foundation supporting cancer patients and family members in need. Each of these exhibits show rainbow girls from different jurisdictions. Though the look may be different, the mission throughout international order of the rainbow for girls is the same, to prepare girls for life through leadership, service, and fun.